and I haven't opened it since they sent it but I wanted us to like unbox it together so you guys could see how the wig looks like um, if you do not know hair caterers by now I've done about a couple of videos for them they sell really affordable wigs that are premium fiber so if you're looking to slay on a budget then look no further than to go and check out hair caterers so oh I love that um, oh. So they sent me um, this hair detangler. I'm just going to ooh, take this out. This is really packaged. Thousand years later. So guys, this is a hair detangler and it's used for fiber synthetic hair. So if you know you've gotten a fiber hair from hair caterers or you've gotten any fiber hair, you need to have this in your house because you need it for your fiber wigs you know how wigs get tangled and they get all cloggy and very disgusting you don't want to have that because girl it can be frustrating so get your head to cut tangles from head kit so oh i got this wig it is called the barbie doll mm -mm -mm. this is how it looks and unboxing it In front it has this and at the back it has it's called the pre-styled wig Barbie doll style it has lace frontals baby hair and it can take heat up to 400 degrees Fahrenheit which is really really nice so washing and care um, tutorial at the back and it tells you what and what not to do with the wig so yeah let's get down to styling so guys i'm just unboxing it so you have to hear my ugly voice up close and i'm just removing the protective net that comes with it i really love how the hair is packaged and the baby hair is left defined and it has this cinderella look you know the way it's packed this is what's trending now by the way um the frontal is too long or the baby hair is too long so obviously i'm obviously going to have to trim that once i want to fix that on my hair um i'm just sizing the wig now to just know where i'm going to obviously put the glue and let me just basically know how it's going to fit and size my head the frontal was too wide so i decided to add foundation and powder to it to give it an original look so by the time i lay it it looks like <laughs> it's my hair so to glue the hair down into my hair i'm just using got to be glue i couldn't wear a wig cap because whenever i wear wig caps my hair itches me terribly so i just glued down to my scalp so I'm tying this with a satin scarf to just keep my hair in place and let the glue sit. I left that for about 5 minutes or 6 minutes and I touched up my makeup then I took it out. When I took it out, I decided to start laying my frontal or cutting my frontal. I tried to use blade, it did not work so life tip, don't use blade. Scissors is very easy and for this, it just literally took out the excess lace itself. It was literally working on its own. The frontal, like I said before, I noticed it was too long, so I decided to trim it a bit with blade. Um, I then went over with my, I really forgot what I've done. <laughs> so I went over with my hair straightener to lay down the edges. Like I said, I felt the frontals were too long for me to do my edges or create my fake edges. So I had to trim it because it was frustrating me, as you can see in this video. I cut and cut and cut till I got my desirable whatever i wanted to get so yeah if it means you cutting to just make yourself look comfortable in that edge girl cut all you need to cut so right now i'm just using heat to melt the lace into my scalp even though it's not going to be perfect but it's that easy voila so you see the design at the back it's so cute it gave me that cinderella or that princessy look and just imagine fixing this on your own you don't even need to go to the salon it's that easy so right now i'm just untying the ribbons that were used to create the princessy look i noticed that they used rubber bands but afterwards it's no longer rubber bands it's literally the hair so you have to be very careful when you're cutting not to cut off the hair itself i noticed that as i was removing it every step of the way was just bringing out a new beautiful coil or a new beautiful color and it was just so incredible so i finally did take everything out and i was just like wow is this me this wig is 
a mamacita wig you know i'm here feeling myself the curls are so beautiful and then guess what the color just changed and it just looked amazing so i decided that i could style it in different ways and this is one of the ways i styled it i styled it all back with just the curls everywhere then i wore a scarf to give myself that you know cute girl look and then i used um the detangler the hair detangler and then i made a side part which i finally stuck with and i really like this side part because it just made me look so cheeky and you know it brought out the real beauty of this hair so that's about all so see you guys bye so much for watching my video today if you like this video don't forget to give me a thumbs up bye guys